Hi guys, this is Sauron. In this video, we will create one snake game in MIT App Inventor. So that's the second part of our game. Okay, so here we go. Now we have to do one more layout. So I'm going to make this one also. Just drag and drop this all. And this one is overall. This one is uh, vertical arrangement, and this one vertical arrangement too. I'm going to make it visible off for this vertical element too and I have to use another one more layout and that should be a game over layout okay so just drag and drop one vertical arrangement and make this fill pattern can we copy paste this let's try me control C control V yes we can amazing that's amazing right so I'm going to delete this one okay and I already have copied this one right make it visible right and i have to change this one uh, start game click on start so we have to just rename this to restart restart okay now we have to use one more thing i am to make this vertical arrangement visible off make this vertical arrangement 2 is visible on and we have to use here one more thing that one is is a score okay so i am using here one more uh, button here or one more label you can use label here so first i need to use your layout and that one is horizontal arrangement this one okay and i'm to make this one with this fill parent and i have to use your two labels first one and that one is second click on the first one label okay and change this text to a score like this and click on another label and make this text is zero okay and change this all font size to at least 20 make it font bold click on another layout this one this should be also 20 and make this one font bold okay this one is the horizontal arrangement too so i'm going to click on it this one is four layout this one is third click on horizontal arrangement and background color we have to change it to at least yeah this one is fine right i'm to make it in a center align horizontal center is center so that one is your score okay now right now we have to click on vertical arrangement and make it visible off and now click on vertical arrangement one and make it visible off Whenever someone open our app, so this screen will display here first. Okay. Now we have to code for this. Whenever someone click on this start button, okay. So we have to start that uh, start the game. So we have to disable this vertical arrangement uh, first uh, first one, and we have to uh, visible off this one, and we have to make visible on for basic vertical arrangement too. Go to the block section, and just click on vertical arrangement plus sign, and click on button. Whenever someone click on button 1, it means the start button. So we have to disable uh, visible off. Side vertical arrangement visible should be false. Okay, like this. Make it false. Oh, and just copy and paste this one. And we have to make vertical arrangement 2 should be true. Like this. Okay, and I'm using your this one. Okay, emulator. So whenever someone click on start, you will find here this where this screen will display second one screen right okay so we have to code for this screen here right so i'm going to make it visible not visible off and make it visible off so we have to do some code so how we can do go to the block section whenever whenever someone click on the start button so we have to make this snack uh, right you know we have to move this snack so what we will do Click on the vertical arrangement too and where is our snack? Click on canvas and image spread. This one is our snack. Okay. You can change all these component but uh, name. Okay. You can rename all these components from here. Click on this image spread and I'm going to change this uh, name SN SP. Right. Image spread SN snack image spread. Okay. So SN SP you will find here. So we have to move this uh, image spread right whenever someone click on the start button so click on this image spread and you will find your speed where is this where is this yes 
set as an SP dot speed to and just drag and drop here and in the left side you will find it variable initialize one variable here and this should be as an SP speed this one is variable and I have to assign this variable is uh, value is 5 I am going to assign this value 5 and just mouse over get as an speed like this fine so now initial in the initial stage the snap speed is 5 right now okay now go to the design uh, here and you'll find this will uh, move in this direction so we have to move uh, we have to move this snack uh, in the up down left and right direction so what we will do whenever whenever someone click on this up button it means this which one this up one it means okay uh, make it this one make it horizontal element click on button 2 it means button 2 it means up so I'm going to rename this up BTN make this one is down BTN okay so no one can use with this uh, with the code okay this one is left BTN and this one is right BTN okay fine now go to the block section whenever someone click on the up BTN so we have to move this snack in the up direction right in so whenever someone click on up BTN so just click on this SNSP it means this one is snack and you will find here the hiding option set as an SP heading so just drag and drop this here and make this heading is 90 okay just type here 90 like this just refresh it and this this one is working or not so whenever someone click on up button you will find that this one is up okay so just copy and paste this copy and paste again and again and make this one 2 3 and 4 it means up button for the up if uh, I have to make it it uh, down so I have to use here minus 90 minus 90 and if you want to make it in the left so you have to make it 180 and if you want to make it in a right so you have to make it 0 so I'm going to change this right between like this okay so, uh, let's see if this one is working or not so I'm going to make it vertical arrangement should be false and uh, vertical arrangement should be visible let's refresh it and how it's work till now I start game I'm going to make it up down left right this one is working perfectly right so now let's do some more code okay so we have to do one more a uh, lot of things here not a lot of it's too, uh, too much small game it's a very small game okay you don't need to worry now whenever whenever the snack is collide with the ball okay it means the food uh, snack food so I'm going to make it visible on whenever this snack collide with this uh, image split it means this sorry this wall it means this image split collide with this wall so we have to make it like a disable or you can make it as a uh, you have to move this wall in the another random position okay so how we can do this? how we can do this go to the block section now whenever so click on SNSP or uh, you can click on wall and when wall dot collide with it means whenever wall collide with anything when we have only one thing here is snack so we have to move this so click on wall and you will find your move uh, option called wall dot move to in the random position so in the max you will find your random option random integer so make it here like this and i'm going to make it 500 and just copy and paste this one also and make it also like see so this will move automatically in the random position okay now we have to uh, increase the snack speed also okay so what we will do whenever this wall collide with snack so we will increase this in a slide global so set global speed is click on max and you will find your plus option just drag and drop this here click on as we get snsp speed here and we will increase it from the one okay so this will uh, the now speed is six okay 
now this one is fine now what we will do we have to uh, increase the score right now we have done the speed option whenever wall collide with the snag so snag speed automatically increase we have to increase the score also so whenever wall collide with the snag so we have to in uh, increase the score also so i am to initialize one more variable here and this one is score score okay and this score should be zero and make this copy this whole content like this okay and then change this global to score and we have to global score plus one right so whenever this uh, okay set global speed now we have to change one more thing uh, one more thing what we need to yeah we have to display the value also right so i am to use your label which one we are using here this one is label 4 it means score and the rename this is score lbl label okay click on okay go to the blog click on score label you will find here score label set score label text this one and this should be get global score this one fine now how we can make game over so whenever this is now collide uh, reach the age it means whenever this will collide with this age of our phone so we have to make it game over so how we can do this that that's very easy so click on this snack option it means in the snsp image split and you will find here when snsp age reached right just try and though we have to disable the horizontal this one vertical arrangement it means to make it false right make it false and we have to enable another vertical arrangement and that one is vertical arrangement 4 and this should be true right we have to uh, make this one set global speed should be also 5 okay so write this okay and one more thing uh, what we need to do we need to uh, age reach this one is false this one is true and global sn speed is 1 right now let's run this app and let's see how it's work or not and whenever we are facing problem we will solve it okay so we have to make it go to the design i'm going to make this vertical arrangement disable and make this vertical arrangement one should be visible right let's see click on start again now i'm going to make it up right and just create down make it you will find here this one is here ball is here it means food is here up left now let's uh, reach the edge you will find here this one is key click on restart button okay we have to code for restart button also let's see so we have to code for restart button so where this is click on vertical arrangement and button 6 this one is restart button restart btn click on ok and go to the block and whenever someone click on restart button so we have to disable it means vertical arrangement 4 should be false it means this one and paste uh, again copy paste and vertical arrangement 2 should be true like this Okay, whenever someone click on the restart button, so you will find here the snack. So where is this snack? In the vertical element to SNSP, we have to move this SNSP. This one copy and paste this. No, no, this one is a ball. SNSP move, SNSP move option. This one SNSP move. Okay, and we have to move this one here. So for the X value, this should be 44 and for the y value this one is 234 okay and now let's see this one is working or not okay we have to make uh, visible off visible on visible off this one is fine visible vertical arrangement 2 should be visible off and vertical arrangement 1 should be visible on refresh this 
and click on start make it game over right let's see how it's work cam is over click on restart button right this one is working yeah perfectly now we have to make uh, we have to change this actually vertical arrangement for a uh, screen we have to make some little change here i am to make it game over this is not a it's not game game over like this so now the game is ready fine so i am to make it disable no make it off vertical element should be off vertical element false this should be enable all right so that's the game here that's the first screen of a game okay so whenever someone click on the start game and you'll find that that's the snack here right you need to click on up button left button down button and right okay but you have to get this food okay so just make it here and make this one left and get this food down right and you have to make it right to get this one food and make it down but if i am not able to get and you will see the snack is reached t h so this game is over you can restart this game again right so click on restart you will find here this if you have any doubt you can ask me on comment and please don't forget to subscribe my channel like this video share this video have a nice day be safe bye bye